person has spoken emphasizing diplomacy. You've spoken increasingly emphasizing the potential for military options. Are you two on the same page? Totally. Uh, I can tell you totally on the same page. And, Secretary, maybe you'd like to make a statement? Well, I think it, you know, it takes a combined uh, message there if we're going to get effective movement out of the regime in North Korea. I think the President's made it clear he, he prefers a diplomatic solution. I think he responded to that in effect just a moment ago. And so I think what the President's doing is trying to support our efforts by ensuring North Korea understands what the stakes are. Speaking of, speaking of the State Department right now, these recent acoustic attacks we've learned about regarding diplomats, American diplomats in Cuba. Who's responsible for the acoustic attacks? Is it Cuba? Is it Russia? Who's to blame for that? We've not been able to determine who is to blame. We do hold the Cuban authorities responsible for the safety and security of all of our people, just as every host country has a responsibility for safety and security of diplomats in their country. So we hold the Cuban authorities responsible for finding out who is uh, carrying out these health attacks on not just our uh, diplomats, but as you've seen now, there are other cases with other diplomats as well. What do you make of this awful situation of them losing their hearing these American diplomats? Yeah, it's awful. You just described it exactly correctly, which is why we're bringing people out.